It's Pete Thorne, welcome to my studio. Thanks for joining me and welcome to my demo of the full tone That 80s Rack Chorus. There it is, sitting on top of my Sir Hedgehog amp. Uh, I used it on that track at the beginning of the video and I'm sure you noticed I was able to achieve some extremely rich, lush, dense, very stereo and decidedly 80s guitar textures using this thing. So, okay, a little bit of history before I get into this unit. The original Tri-Chorus units were produced in the 80s uh, under the names Ditronics, Dino My Piano, and maybe one other, I can't remember right now. But essentially they were all the same design. An all analog chorusing unit that's actually three independent analog choruses in one box. Uh, they had a, a really, really unique sonic uh, quality to them. Uh, very, very complex sounding. And you heard guys like Mike Landau and Dan Huff, great studio guitar players, use them on all kinds of tracks in the 80s and the 90s. And so the sound became very popular, but there actually wasn't very many of them produced and they're really, really hard to find now if you can find one at all. Very, very expensive. So, Full Tone set out to recreate the original Tri-Chorus design, and, uh, and I mean recreate it right down to the exact circuit, except for the fact that in areas where they could actually improve on the circuit, like lower the noise floor, using better components like uh, metal film resistors and um, gold-plated contacts and things like that, they've gone ahead and done that. So it's actually built better than the originals. Um, as far as controls go, it's extremely easy to use. Um, you've basically got a bypass switch here, and then you've got a switch here that uh, allows you to switch in a preset mode. Now the preset mode is kind of the classic tri-chorus sound, and incidentally, that's the sound I used on the song at the beginning of the video. Uh, you can also switch in, into manual mode here. That's going to give you independent uh, uh, controls here. They're called intensity controls for the left, center, and right chorus signals. And then you've got a master rate control here. Uh, interestingly, uh, you can actually use the preset and manual modes together. And that's actually going to give you a unique, kind of very uh, co uh, complex, kind of watery tone that, that I found really cool. So I'm going to show you what that sounds like in a little bit here in the demo. Uh, so. Yeah, basically, uh, without further ado, let's get to some sound examples, because that's what you guys want to hear. I just want to give you a bit of background on what I'm using. Uh, uh, I'm playing uh, my old Strat and my Sir Classic S into the Sir Hedgehog amp. I've got the Hedgehog set extremely clean, because uh, that's kind of what you want with the tri thing, is a clean sound. Uh, I'm using an uh, exotic compressor pedal running into the, front of the, uh, in, in the front of the Hedgehog. I'm coming out of the effects end of the Hedgehog into the tri unit, and then I'm coming stereo out of the tri unit uh, into the effects return of the Hedgehog and also the effects return of one of my PT-100 heads down here, uh, also from Sur. I'm coming out of both amps into Sur reactive load boxes, and I'm using some speaker simulation in Logic. Okay, let's get on to some sound examples. Here we go. It's the That 80s Rack Chorus from Full Tone. Thank you. 
Thanks for watching my video on the Full Tone That 80s Rack Chorus. Sounds just great to me. Uh, they've reproduced this thing in classy, fine fashion, and it's a lot of fun. Hey, some of my favorite guitar sounds are heavily chorus guitar sounds from guys like Andy Summers, uh, Alex Lifeson, guitar sounds from The Pretenders, Steve Stevens. I like chorus. I'm not afraid to admit it. And this thing is a lot of fun, and it sounds just amazing. So um, you can check it out further at the website you see there on the screen. I should mention uh, they've sourced enough original analog uh, Panasonic uh, Bucket Brigade chips to produce 3,200 of these units, and after that they're going to be all gone. So if you're interested in one, maybe snap one up soon. Uh, all right, you can check it out further at the website you see there on your screen. And uh, hey, hit subscribe if you haven't. Come back and see my channel often for more videos. I am Pete Thorne. Over and out.